Hey guys, how's it going? So for this video, I wanted to discuss and analyze one of the most intriguing as well as enigmatic scenes to take place over the entire course of Season 4 of Better Call Saul, which displayed to us the first ever on-screen meeting between Gus Fring and Lalo Salamanca, and how this scene could possibly impact the storyline of these two characters moving forward in the plot of Season 5 of Better Call Saul. Okay, so following Lalo Salamanca's highly anticipated appearance in the plot of Season 4 of Better Call Saul in the episode entitled Cushada, he would then, in the following episode, meet with Gus Fring at Los Pollos Hermanos, following the off-screen conversation that he had with his uncle Hector at Casa Tranquila in the episode entitled Vitazane. During this conversation, we would see Lalo, among other things, thank Gus for saving Hector's life following his stroke, as well as insult Don Eladio by insinuating that Eladio enjoys using the bad blood between Gus and the Salamancas for his own self-interests. This conversation would then conclude with Lalo stating to Gus that he would be in town for a while and that he is looking forward to the two of them maintaining a cordial relationship. So, taking this information about this meeting between these two characters into account, while it's impossible to know what precisely Lalo's intentions were in this scene and why exactly he decided to meet with Gus at Los Pollos Hermanos following his meeting with Hector, what nonetheless really stands out about this scene is that following his meeting with Gus, we would then see Lalo seemingly go directly against the cordiality that he offered to maintain with Gus when we saw him doing some clandestine reconnaissance of Gus Fring's drug operation over over the course of the season 4 finale. So, taking these actions by Lalo over the course of Season 4 into consideration, I think that one possible explanation for Lalo meeting with Gus prior to him surveilling his operations could have been as an attempt to feign a genial and hospitable presence to Gus as a means of deception of his true intentions. However, at the same time, as we would all see following the end of the meeting between these two characters, Gus clearly seemed to not be fooled by Lalo, and if anything, Lalo meeting with Gus appeared to do the exact opposite of these possible intentions due to the fact that this meeting seemed to put Gus on a higher level of alert and also likely contributed to the fact that Gus seemed to know that Lalo was the unknown figure who had tracked down Werner during the season 4 finale when this information was presented to him by Mike. Furthermore, in my opinion, what also makes Lalo's actions following his meeting with Gus even more intriguing is that due to the fact that Lalo's conversation with Hector immediately prior to his meeting with Gus took place off screen, we cannot know for certain if Lalo's actions following his meeting with Hector were directly in accordance with a calculated and methodical plan that he carried out on behalf of Hector to discover more about the inner workings of Gus Fring's drug operation or if some or even possibly all of Lalo's actions following his meeting with Hector were done on his own accord or possibly even against the wishes of Hector. However, that being said, what I think we can know heading into next season is that Lalo's actions over the course of Season 4, nonetheless, seem to present him as a very capable and dangerous antagonist who has certainly chosen to combat with an extremely adept and formidable adversary in Gus Fring. And while it does appear that Gus may currently have the upper hand in this engagement heading into Season 5, at the same time, I think there could be much more to Lalo's plan over the course of Season 4 than met the eye, and as a result, I think we will see much more of Lalo's reasoning behind all of his actions over the course of Season 4, as well as his extremely complex personality revealed to us as part of his plot involving Gus Fring in the fifth season of Better Call Saul. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video and also want to see additional videos where I discuss and analyze the plot of Better Call Saul, then definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any new videos leading up to the premiere of Season 5. As always, my name is Anton Jackson. Thanks again for watching.